All right, yeah, yeah. Hey, hey, champion. I uh, just talked to this guy tonight. Uh, Matthew, uh, didn't you meet this champion? What, what, how did you meet this champion? Yeah, so I was at Oceanside Outreach on the pier and um, and just listening to the Holy Spirit and praying in tongues for all the way from Encinitas to Oceanside. And, um, Wasn't that after I gave you the word that uh, you'd be brave or something? What was that word? Oh, oh. okay. So Artie told me about Revelation 12.11. I was quoting Revelation 12.11, but I left out the part. Um, we overcome by the blood of the Lamb and the word of our testimony, loving not our own life unto death. That's and the part Lord of the says, verse. I, I don't get why people why people leave that part out, and I don't want to die in, in my bed. I want to die in the battlefield, and I got fired <laughs> up, and I went out there. And then you went out and got yeah. this jab, yeah. yeah. And, then, and then he gets, and then he he gets got. I was I was speaking in tongues all the way from Encinitas. I was driving from Encinitas to Oceanside, speaking in tongues, and then getting powered with the, by the Holy Ghost, calling down angels to come down. And, and reinforcement and then I got out and I started praying for people and then God tells me to stop and that he'll give, he'll, he'll give me a sign. And then so I started walking and then, and then you're, what are their names? You're two, Ashley and Matthew. Yeah, yeah they, they, start, they just say like, they yell out, Jesus. Oh and, yeah, and well, that's so a like, sign, okay, that's man. It. So I go over there and then they said, he just got baptized, but I knew it was water style. And then I asked you, and then so I was like, no, you're gonna get baptized right now with Holy Spirit, what happened? And I got baptized in the Holy Spirit by this guy right wow, here. Wow, you got it yeah, whacked, huh? Everything, I closed my eyes, everything was white. It's like I was going up, being risen up to, lifted up to heaven. Hallelujah. Yeah. Wow, wow. Yeah. And, and then how did you hook up with me? What, what happened? Oh, well, I was actually at church last week, and one of the guys, Mark Olasowski, you might know him, and... Oh, yes. you know Mark? You, oh, yeah, yeah. oh, yeah! <laughs> yeah. And so Mark said, oh, you yeah. gotta check out Art with the FBI. So I went home after church that day and Googled Art FBI. The first video I saw was uh, intro to praying in tongues, and I never prayed in tongues. And I just listened to the video. Next thing you know, I'm praying in tongues. <laughs> wow, and, and were you a little skeptical of what you're saying that it just broke through? How did it go? Oh, yeah, I was skeptical first. You know, I was hearing like different things from different people. I'm a new Christian, you know, four months in, and so obviously I've heard a lot of different things about it, and not a lot of churches teach it, but now I found out, you know, it's the real truth. Right. And so. Uh, after that skepticism was gone, you know, after Art uh, gave all the scriptures, after he gave all the scriptures yeah. about being totally biblical. Oh, tongues. that really helped you? Oh, yeah. It oh, got yeah. my mind set up. Yeah. And I was fully ready to just have God pray for me. Yeah. So it just popped out? Did it flow out good? Oh, yeah. You know, I wasn't a pro at first, but... Uh, well, let's see. Yeah, let's let's pray now. Go ahead and yeah, pray yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. Isn't that wild? But you know, Mark, you know, did Mark tell you that that I trained him up? No. Oh no, him and Susan both. They were in my ministry for years, and they 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 I I trained them up from the beginning. They made them the fireballs they are today. They'll tell you that. Oh wow. Oh yeah. In fact, I took I took a group of your church to the Indian Navajo Indian Reservation. You can see it on the. Oh, is that when you did that cast out that demon? Oh yeah, the cast. Look at my internet. They'll show it. It's crazy, crazy time over there. Oh yeah. Yeah, I mean, cast out some wild demons with. Who's the girl's name? The couple of young girls that went with them to the Navajo Reservation that we got from your church. And they went there with us too. Wow. Oh yeah, we had. It's really a wild video. You ought to check it out. I will. Yeah. And you know what else is cool? He told me that he launched out, and you. But now you've been out praying for people, right? And get what? You. You can't tell me that you're getting healings. No, you don't know this now. You can't do that. <laughs> That's, that. That can't be right because only I should be able to do that. <laughs> so what have you been doing? <laughs> uh, well, uh, I got a full body healing about a month ago. The day after that, I started going out and just telling people about Jesus and the testimony they couldn't refuse. Yeah. And uh, within the first week of me going out, uh, praying over people in Jesus' name to get healed, 20 people that week got healed. Uh, what? First, oh, God, oh, God. <laughs> what? Yeah, first day, nine people got healed. Nine for and, nine people. And a demon got delivered. Uh, first are you, day. No, no, you, no, 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 no. You can't deliver. A, uh, you can't do a deliver, deliverance right like that. That's a, what happened on that? 
Uh, well, I was uh, just about to leave our spot we were at for the day, and of course, God wanted to throw me in this situation the first day. Uh, a woman starts having a seizure, and she's on the ground, her husband's over her, and I was an EMT at first, you know, Ocean Life for yeah. the last five years, so normally I do EMT things. Uh, but what's more powerful than a medical profession? Uh, Jesus. Yeah. Okay, so I said, uh, I started praying for healing uh, over this woman. And next thing you know, she wasn't getting better. Her eyes were rolled back in her head. She was foaming at the mouth, cringing everything. And so Holy Spirit just told me to start delivering a demon. And I said, okay, God. The Holy Spirit said that. Mm -hmm. Ooh. So, and, and this woman could barely breathe at the time. And I said, get out now in the name of Jesus and next thing you know this woman uh, was possessed and she said no <laughs> <laughs> and I said yes get out now this is your eviction notice in the name of Jesus and she starts slapping her husband who's over her trying to help she starts trying to hit me and I said get out now and cl everything climax she relaxed her eyes rolled back to normal she came to, she was fully delivered in the name of Jesus. Whoa, now this is what I call Holy Ghost radical starting. This is what you get, you get filled with the Holy Ghost, and then all of a sudden you got this power in you and you're speaking in tongues, and, and look what happens to you. And when did you get that full body of the healing? Uh, a when? day after I got baptized oh, in the Holy Spirit, oh! 24 hours. <laughs> Whoa! See, this is how God works, guys. They're how they go. Now, uh, guys, uh, you, you may look at my twin back here next door to me. Uh, he's, he's stealing my anointing, guys. He's stealing my anointing. I'm, I'm, I'm a little bit. <laughs> hey, well, thanks for the testimony. It'd be awesome, man. Okay, oh, yeah. I right, love you, man. Yeah. All right, and we're excited to see what God's going to do in you, man. <laughs> I'm excited. Awesome.